In this video, I show you how to set up a Discord verification bot. If you're new to the channel, please go down below and consider subscribing to the channel. And once you've done that, please go down below and consider leaving a like as well. I really do appreciate it. And please do watch this video right until the end to the full steps and let's go and get straight into this. Here we are on Discord and let's go and get straight into this guide. So the first thing you need to go and do is go and add the bot which we're gonna go and use for the verification. Let's go and open up Google. So here we are on Google and the bot I personally use is called Capture Bot. So just type in Capture Bot, just like so, and go and press enter. And the one we're using is Capture.Bot. So here we are on the website and here it is, account verification for your Discord server done right. So all you need to do is go and click secure your server. So I'm gonna click here. And as you can see, we then goes and takes us to this Discord authorization page. And we need to go and choose the server you want to go and add your bot to. So in this case, I want the Guide Realm server. If you can't see this, your servers here, this is probably because you're using an alt account or something like that. As you can see, you can go and click not you and then go and sign into the account you want to go and use. So I'm gonna go and click continue and then I'm just gonna go and give permission to this. And as you can see, I just have to do a quick capture. And here we are in Discord. I'm now gonna to go to my Guide Realm server and as you can see, the capture bot is now being added. So the next thing we need to go and do is, is actually go and configure the roles of unverified users and verified users. So to go and do that, go to the top right where it says your guide realm server or your server, and then you want to go to your server settings, so go and click server settings just here, and here we are. Then all you want to do is come down to roles, which is the second one down. Then what you want to do is come under default permissions first, so this is everyone. This applies to all of the server members, and especially people when they first join, because this is basically the unverified role, and then we're gonna go and create a verified role as well. Just to confirm what server permissions you need, so you need view channels to be on, and then you can also have add reactions, and then you really do need a read message history. You must have these on. The other ones are gonna be sort of up to you, but these are sort of the essential you need. Then go and click save changes. Then once you finish, you can go and click on the back button. Now all you want to do is go and create a new role. So I'm gonna go and click create role and I can go and name this. Members unverified just like this, but it's completely up to you what you name it and you can choose any color as well. That's literally it. And then you want to come to the permissions and now you need to go and configure the members permissions. So I've gone through this role and had everything I want, including voice channel settings and tons of others just like that. So the next thing we need to go and do is go and create a brand new category for the verify section. So I'm gonna right click here and go and click create category. And then I'm gonna go and name this verify just like so, as this is the category where users need to go and verify themselves. So we've now created um, the category and now you want to go and click create channel and go and press text and then verify here or you can name it whatever you'd like. So I'm gonna click create channel. So there we go. So now the rest of these channels, you probably want to go and hide until they've been verified. So go and right click on them and then go and click edit category and go to permissions. And then you want to be a private category and all you want is to go and add members or roles. And then you want to go and just add members just like so and click done and then click save changes. And you also want to go and add bots as well. Um, I'm not gonna bother right now. And then I'm also gonna go, go and do it for the voice channels as well. So now when somebody joins the server, all they're gonna go and see is this verify role here. Now just before we go and get into the setup phase, you wanna quickly go back to your role. So go into your um, server settings and then go to roles. You need to make sure that CaptureBot is above all the others, just like so, and then go and click save changes. And now let's go and hop into this. So come to a text channel and all you want to do is type in slash config. And then you need to go and type in roles add, just like so. And then you want to go and click on here. And then we just go and type in the role. So you want to go and select your members or verified channel and then go and press enter. So it's now added that role. Now we need to go and add the channel to where people can go and verify themselves. So go and type in slash config and then you need to go and look for verification channel set or type in it but like that and there it is. So then all you want to do is go and type in this case verify here and then go and press enter. And as you can see, it's now set the channel to there. Now you need to go to the channel where you just set the verification channel to. So in this case, for me, it was verify here. Then all you need to do is type in slash config again, like this. And what you want to do is go and type in panel setup. So I'm gonna type in panel setup, just like so. Click here and then go and hit enter. As you can see, we've now gone and added this. So now when somebody goes and joins the server, they need to go and click on the verify channel and they're gonna go and see this option here and then they can go and click on verify and then they're gonna go and get the members role. As you can see, I don't have that role at the moment. So you need to go and click on verify and then you're gonna go and get a message like this and all you need to do is go and click on here and then go and click yep. And now what it's gonna go and do, it's gonna open this tab up here, open on my other window and then you just need to go and click login 
and then you need to go and log in with your Discord account to go and prove um, that you're real and you're not a bot. And then you'll need to go undo the capture just like so, hit verify, and there we go. You can then go back to the server, and as you can see, um, have now been successfully verified. If you found this video useful, please go down below and consider subscribing to the channel. Leave a like for more. Peace.